smokehouse barbecue sandwich. They also have a chicken fajita rice bowl, a bread and baked chicken sandwich, a barbecue chicken sandwich, a sun butter and jelly sandwich, and a yogurt buffet. Today's hot steam. Today's hot vegetable is steamed sunshine carrots. We also have our unlimited Gardevoir and our choice of milk. <laughs> The lost and found for any lost items in the front office there are many house keys eyeglasses d um, electronic devices maybe you need an iphone maybe you lost it if you lost any of this come to your lost and found table in your grade area there are some in the lunchroom and also come to the main office if you have lost something very valuable hey jazz didn't running club already ends no it didn't end guys because running club is this wednesday April the 3rd and April the 10th because of cancellations and postponed stuff. So, you're going to be running for a while, buddy, every Wednesday till April 10th. Hi, welcome to the weather. Today is Wednesday, March 27th. Today there's going to be some sun in the morning with a high of 53 and a low of 33. Bye! Breaking news! Miss Orr gave the 6th graders assigned seats for lunch. And this is tea time. Back with your host, Jazzy and Hadia. Hadia. And today we're going to be talking about how you guys can prevent 7th graders, 8th graders can prevent having a science seat. Exactly, and how 6th graders can get their seat privileges back. Because nobody wants to sit in a science seat. Exactly, because it sucks. Okay, guys. Rule 1, or tip 1. Do not get up unless that you get your hand raised and the teachers tell you. Because they get annoyed by that, guys. Teachers can get annoyed too, you know. Okay, tip 2. Don't like roam around and go to different tables because mm -hmm. teachers notice that and that's kind of why we're going to get assigned seats. They're not blind, guys, unless they take off their glasses. Unless you have 20-20 vision. Like, yeah. not me. Like her. I, uh, yeah. Okay. Exactly. <laughs> so don't get up when you're not supposed to and raise your hand when you want to get up. Mm-hmm. And um, rule number three, the final rule, was that how you? You don't scream in people's faces. Exactly. No. <laughs> don't scream at all, guys. Not in the lunchroom. This is not a time... This is a privilege, guys. Time to socialize with your friends. Exactly. And eat good lunch by the cafeteria staff. And that's your host, Jasmine Ahadia. Thank you for watching Tea Time. Bye. Hey, guys. Welcome back to On The Stand History, where we talk about things that happened on The Stand History. Today is March 27th, and back in 1513, the Spanish conquistador Juan Ponce de Leon, who was trying to search for the Fountain of Youth, First, si first sighted Florida with his expedition team. Thank you so much for watching and tune in tomorrow. It's trivia time, everybody. Today's trivia question is, traditionally, how many wonders of the world are there? Is it A, eight, B, nine, C, six, or D, seven? C. Not C. Um, the correct answer is D. Seven. He's out. Back with another game of Where's Your Prong Shoe? Let's go find him. Where's Your Prong Shoe, everybody? Is that Shoe Prong Shoe? That's his jacket. Whoa. Oh my gosh. It's Carter. It was a decoy. Where, where is he? Wait a second. Da -na -na. There's oh, Shabrong Shoe! Thanks for watching. Don't forget to create, lead, inspire, motivate, and believe.